All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Harakakodash. A double honors unto the elders and apostles of GMS Great Millstone. And a sincere Shalom to Yahakim bringing out this word in diligence and in truth. Hey, now, um, this lesson is going to be, you know, on when it descends of Sodom. Hey, and, and this, I'm going to start off right at the point to lock in. Um, matter of fact, there's uh, Ezekiel 16 and 48, and it reads, As I live, saith the Lord Yahweh, Sodom thy sister hath not done, she nor her daughters, as thou hast done, thou and thy daughters. Behold, this was the iniquity of thy sister Sodom, pride, fullness of bread, abundance, it's like an abundance of idleness was in her and in her daughters. Neither did she strengthen the hand of the poor and the needy. And they were haughty and committed abomination before me, Therefore, I took them away as I saw good, right? So we understand that a Yahabashim Yashai destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah due to all the wickedness and that was within it, right? It, it was just, it wasn't just, you know, the, 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 uh, L, the whole alphabet agenda that was going on back then. You know, the scriptures just listed, you know, other reasons as to why Sodom and Gomorrah were destroyed as well. And when you take a look at the list, a, these same, uh, sins, you know, these same iniquities, which Sodom got destroyed for, hey, Babylon is gonna be judged off of that same, uh, for that same reason, man. Right? Because here in this place, you see what pride at an all-time high, fullness of bread, which is the point that I want to touch on, hey, because on TikTok and all these social media platforms, hey, you literally have people, you know, eating or, or showing themselves eating, you know, uh, large amounts of food. A and um is gluttony, you know. You have people showing forth eating challenges. You have people just a just being just ultimately just fat asses, man. A and that's that's going off. It says is the NLT. It says Sodom's sins were pride, gluttony, and laziness, while the poor and needy suffered outside her door. And I ain't gonna even play this video, a but as you see it, a it's a, a N dub right here, and she has a, a side of chips and she's just on this screen and she finishes this shit in like five bites man and now it may seem trivial you know or, or pointless to someone who doesn't understand <clears throat> you know why this lesson is is uh a why y'all bashim my shot put the spirit on me to, to bring out this lesson hey but this is hey as we look at you know the matter of fact let me just grab the precept in the book of romans In the book of Ecclesiastes, right? Matter of fact, I'm gonna start in Ecclesiastes. There's Ecclesiastes one and nine. It says that thing or the thing that have been is that which shall be, and that which is done is that which shall be done, and there is no new thing under the sun. Because when you take a look at these past kingdoms, man. A uh, specifically even Rome and Greece, or it's like a Greece and then Rome, right? The same reasons, you know, in which Rome fell, a America repeats that same pattern. That's why the scripture says that which was written aforetime. This is the book of Romans, so lucky. Oops. Romans fifteen and four. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning. That we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. So here it is, you know, the the the, the ways of the past kingdoms a hey, show up in the next kingdom uh to come, man. So the Grecian, the Roman system, or, or the beast system, a hey, America has just uh technologically advanced that system. So when you're seeing things like shopping malls, when you're seeing things as uh fast food or comfort foods, a hey, Rome had these as well. You see bread and circus, the gladi gladiator sports. These are all the things in which the Roman society upheld to distract the people from the real issues. So just like these videos here hey, that are going viral, right, of people sitting down and being gluttons. Hey, well, this shows the decline of this society, man. Right. And comparing it to a, a kingdom or a, comparing it to, um, you know, a, a society like Sodom and Gomorrah. A is, a is a great example of America's judgment, right? Because we understand, A, that the same fate and the same patterns bring forth the same result.
This is Jude. The seventh verse. And it reads, Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication and going after strange flesh, are set forth an example suffering the vengeance of eternal fire. Right, and this is what America opposed. You know? That whole uh, um, demonic agenda. Right? A, the gluttony. The fullness of bread, as the scripture says. Pride. And when we go into the book of Obadiah, it tells you. Isaiah 2, it tells you. You know? These people are the proudest people here. Oh, America would never go through this. We got the greatest um, We got the greatest military. You you could hear how they, how they bring it out, man. And it said what? Regard not the life of the poor or the needy. Here it is, especially in Vegas. A place that has a buffet open every day. And not just, oh, breakfast. No, it's breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And you got people on the streets that are hungry. And they what they do here is they'll throw all the buffet food out. <clears throat> and put uh, locks on the bins so that those who don't have can't eat. And, and it goes beyond that, you know? You have hotels out here that routinely throw away, you know, mattresses, sheets, but they don't just throw them away. They, they actually rip them up or shred them so that people can't use them. And people people don't understand, oh, this country is so, hey, bro, Yahabashi Masha is going to destroy this place. As, as good or as well as you really believe that it is, hey, the Lord is going to show you hey, that this place is hell. The closer we get into the end, hey, that sentiment and your love for this place is going to diminish. And it should already be gone, man. It should already be gone. Folly here, as the scriptures say, folly is set in great dignity. This is some folly shit. And it's not just her page. You have thousands of pages dedicated to people being gluttons. Being straight gluttons. And then you have millions of people that like these videos and follow these folks. Completely distracted from everything that's going on. Hey, but call Allah and Yahweh Hashem El Shai, man. Hey, because we know, we understand, and we're fighting. You know, as for everybody else, hey, fuck them, man. Hey, these are just uh, Babylonians, man. Hey, so Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the body. I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Harakakwadash. A double honors unto the elders and apostles of GMS Great Millstone, and a sincere shalom to Yaakim bringing out this word in diligence and in truth. Shalom.